Hello and welcome back to our channel. So students, in this video, I will discuss you the important tips you need to remember in your CCMA subject before the examination. Okay, so what are the important tips? I hope that you have watched every video in our channel, expression video, quick revision, paper pattern, everything I have uploaded regarding this uh, CCMA. So before the examination, you need to remember some important tips in your, especially for CCMA subject. In this video, we will discuss that. Okay, mainly four things you need to remember in this uh, CCMA subject ma, when you are attempting your examination of your final. So this is, this is the thing you need to understand, you need to follow, you need to uh, remember these tips before the examination. So what are the tips? First one, black pen hand calculator. Oh, what, a, what is this? I know that we need to use calculator, you need to use, yes. You need to use it, but still I am remembering. This is one of the main thing. Again and again and again, students are asking in the comment box, what happened if you use blue pen? What happened if you use blue pen? No, don't use blue pen. Even the blue pen is also, like you can use it, but my preference, my suggestion, if you want to get a good correction, good evaluation means, it's your responsibility to follow certain things. No, use black pen calculator compulsory so some of the students what they will think means they will do the hand calculation i am a hand calculation i will do it don't do that so compulsory calculation use change okay na? and second one thing is formulas you have to remember formulas and pro formulas. so because out of 80 marks 45 to 50 marks will be allotted to the formulas and pro formulas only even you observe it, chapter 1 by pro formulas you are having, in chapter 3 you are having uh, pro formula, chapter 1 formulas you are having, yes, formula based problematic only you are having. So out of 80 marks, nearly 50 marks they will give it for the formula and pro forma only. How students are able to draw the pro forma before the examination, before 2 to 3 hours uh, before the examination, just revise your pro forma, what you are having in the debit side, what you are having in the credit side, how we are calculating, what are the columns you are having in this. This is very much important. Because formulas and pro forma, you are not able to write it by your own, no. It is standard as it is whatever you are having in your material, like that only you need to write it, yes or no. Like that's why pro forma and formulas just by heart before the examination. And the third one is theoretical answers. What is this theoretical answers means? Attempting answers confidently without doing strike offs, without even hesitating of writing three sides of your answers. If you are attempting 12 marks a theory question means three sides compulsory. Don't forget it. Don't forget this. Okay. Front, back and front three sides must and should you need to write it at any cost. See my simple thing. Whether you know or don't know the answer also, just give an attempt. How much you are capable of having the knowledge about the particular topic, just put on the paper. Because I can assure that the students who are prepared 100%, the students who are knowledge, having knowledge about the problematic thing, they can able to write theory questions also. Give equal preference to theory because this is the last semester. So what are the question paper is there in nearly 45% to 50% half of the paper you are getting theory also. One theory, one problematic, one theory, one problematic, one theory, one problematic. Because what university will think means they need to pass uh, regular students of 6th semester. They need to pass the students. So that's why they will give equal, equal, equalable chance to this uh, theoretical answers also. And the last one and the important one is attempt every question attempt five long five short either it might be problematic or theoretical answers compulsory five long five short you need to attempt it at any cost in the three hours of your duration you need to attempt five long and five short don't uh, like time is not sufficient i am unable to write some of the students what they will do means if they don't know the answer they will not write it but my suggestion is, if you don't know the also, just write it. Whatever you are understanding by seeing the question, how much you are understanding that, you put it on the paper. So this four important tips is done in the CCMA subject. I hope that you have got clarity. 
so because i have personally experienced about these four things so just follow these four things it will be helpful for you to easily pass in the subject and you can easily get good grades in your ccm subject okay i hope that you have got clarity if you have any further doubts let me know in the comment section all the very best for your examination and preparation see you all in the next video bye bye students